Hello and welcome back to Tenorshare everyone. Apple users have always found it easy to transfer data between their old and new iPhones, thanks to the quick start feature. However, this feature is only available for brand new iPhones that haven't been activated or don't have any data on them. Cause to use this feature, you'll need to factory reset your iPhone or ensure that it hasn't been activated. This means that you'll have to erase all the data you've saved on your iPhone if already activated and use it for a while. Still, I will show you how to use quick start feature step by step and one other method to transfer data from your old iPhone to your any iPhone without erasing data. Join me and let's explore these methods together. Method 1. Transfer iPhone data to any iPhone with quick start. I have two iPhones with me at the moment. The iPhone on my left hand is the one that needs to transfer data, and I will call it the old iPhone from now on. On my right hand, I have the iPhone that needs to receive the data, which I will now call the new iPhone. A little pause here, if you already activated the iPhone and have data on the new iPhone, and you don't want to erase the data, you can try method 2 here. Before we start to use the feature, you need to check a few things. The first one is make sure both phones have more than 50% power, if don't, don't rush it, charge them till have enough power. The second step is to ensure that the Wi-Fi signal is strong and stable, and that the network is functioning correctly. You can verify this by playing a YouTube video to check if it is working properly. Cause if the network is not stable and not working, the transfer will be interrupted. The third one is to make sure your old iPhone is in a formal version of iOS, not public beta or developer beta, or it has a very high chance will fail on transfer. Now that you have completed the necessary preparations, we can proceed with the transfer process. If you haven't turned on your new iPhone, turn it on now. If you already activated your iPhone, go to Settings, General, scroll down and tap Transfer or Reset iPhone option. Choose Erase All Content and Settings, Continue. Wait until the erase process is over. Close up your two iPhone and scroll your new iPhone to quick start page. You should see the quick start window pops up on old iPhone. If it didn't pop up, check your old iPhone Bluetooth settings and make sure it is on. Tap continue. Now you can use the old iPhone to scan the new iPhone or you can choose authenticate manually. Do what you like, I will use the scan here. Now it's setting up your new iPhone, it might take a while. On the iMessage page, tap continue or not. You can set up Face ID here if you want, but I will skip it. Create a password if you like. Here is the transfer data page, tap continue. Agree with the terms. Here you can check out the settings that transfer from the old iPhone. You can set up those settings again by tapping customize option. But I will tap continue here, and continue with the settings. Now you can log in with Apple ID that used on your old iPhone to get back those apps that download on it. Then the transfer process will begin, it will take a while if you have a lot of data to transfer, be patient. Once it's done, your iPhone will restart. Then you should see all your apps videos, photos, or music and any other data has been transferred to your new iPhone. The data on both phones should now be identical. If you wish to keep the data on your new iPhone or only transfer specific data from your old iPhone, or what's worse, your Wi-Fi is in a bad condition, then you should follow the next method. Method 2. Transfer iPhone data to any iPhone with iCare phone. If you have been using your new iPhone for some time and only need to transfer some of the data from your old iPhone, iCareFone is the ideal tool for you. iCareFone is a powerful iPhone data management and transfer tool that offers three main features, manage, backup, and transfer, as well as many other functional features. With iCareFone, you can transfer over 100 gigabytes of data to your iPhone in just 20 minutes. The link to the tool has been provided in the description for you to check out. Once installed, connect your old iPhone to your PC or Mac and open iCareFone. Let's get into the backup record section, you should see your backup package here if you have, easy manage to you. 
Click the backup option here, choose what kind of file type you want to transfer. Here I will choose videos, photos, and music as example. You can choose whatever you need, or choose them all, then click edit, choose a folder to place them and click OK. Once you have made your selection, click on the backup option to begin the backup process. The process will not take long, depending on your data size. After the backup process is complete, you can select the view backup data option to verify if any data has been missed out during the backup. You can see all my videos, photos, music are showing on the list. Now, disconnect the old iPhone and connect the new iPhone to iCare phone. Now choose the data you need, and click restore to device option. Wait a minute. Now you can see part of my old iPhone data has been transferred to my new iPhone successfully. It's pretty easy and no need to erase any data from your new iPhone. Go try it. What's more, if you're looking to transfer data from an Android phone to your new iPhone, you can check out this video. Okay, we have reached the end of the video. I hope that you found it useful. If you face any problems during the transfer process, please leave a comment and we will assist you immediately. Don't forget to subscribe for more iPhone and Android tips. Until next time, take care.